more than anything else, looking into 2019, we have leveling economic activity in North America and the potential really by 2021 for a, a U.S. recession. And with that and rising interest rates and tightening demand, there's leveling, leveling off of housing markets and I think a shift of that demand towards, towards more affordable product. With 400,000 net new immigrants to Canada every year, driving about 200,000 household formations in Canada every year, these are record levels of demand. So it's not a question of whether there's going to be demand, it's more a question of how that demand is going to be supplied and it's going to have to be delivered more affordably to meet the challenges of mortgage qualification under higher interest rates. So for builders in 2019, the big challenge is on the cost front. Rising land costs that are continuing to rise, construction costs continuing to rise, and pre-selling projects in that cost-rising environment where margins are compressing we've seen some projects actually cancel and withdraw. So those pressures are still there. We expect those pressures to subside as the year moves on and levels off in activity. Growth in 2019 is gonna level off in real estate markets. So the clients and businesses that are best positioned to weather that and maintain better growth profiles are those that have lean cost structures, have scale and the ability to actually position product to the affordable end of the market that will still maintain the strongest demand. 